Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to explicitly set the scale options of a measure in OAC visualization. Now in this table, I have the abbreviate properties to, uh, set to on, turned on for all of the measures as you can see on my screen. And when it is on, OAC determines the best scale options to display the abbreviate value. So in this example, sales is represented as in thousands, target sales in millions, quantity and profit in thousands as well. We have added additional scale options to the abbreviate property. Let's review that. So oftentimes as an author, I would like to explicitly define what my scale option of a measure uh, should be when it is rendered on the UI. So let's expand on the abbreviate property for um, sales in this case. And you can see that in addition to turning on or off the property, the author can now explicitly state how they want to represent the abbreviated value to be displayed in UI. So for sales, I'm going to say I want to display it in millions. For target sales, I want to say I, the value to be displayed in billions. For quantity order, let me explicitly state it, uh, the value to be displayed in thousands and profit as well uh, in thousands. You can see that when I set the explicit scale options, now my sales is represented as a, a two digit decimal value abbreviated to millions. Target sales is represented uh, in the billion scales and quantity and profit in thousands. Thank you for watching this video.